Hello, my name is Ijaz, and this is Revolution on the PS3. I'm using the Peacekeeper, and I do go flawless in the game, which is pretty cool. So this video is um, is just my thoughts about the Revolution map pack, whether you not uh, whether you should get it or not. So there's four maps: a new gun, a zombie map, and a new mode um, turned where you become a zombie. But I haven't I haven't actually tried that yet. So I'm just going to talk about the multiplayer maps. Now the multiplayer maps are amazing. Like they're so amazing. The map layout is perfect. The color palette is amazing. Peacekeeper is not overpowered, but it's it's a good gun. It's a really really good gun. And you see in this gameplay, I actually do wreck havoc in this game with this gun. It's amazing. Now downhill, hydro, grind, and mirage, all perfect maps. Spawns are a little a little bit off, but that's that's right. That's right. Um, but overall, this this DLC is looking really good. Really really good. It's definitely worth buying. It's eleven pounds on PS3 right now, and um, Peacekeeper, really epic. So um, Mirage, Mirage is a really good map. It's um, quite quite big. The middle bit is just it's just arcs to die. I mean, if you go into the middle bit in the map, you're gonna die instantly. But overall, it's a really good map. Downhill, first snowy map, and that's gonna be one of my favorite maps in the DLC. Th this this map is amazing. I like this map because the, the the layout is really good. Yeah, it's really good. Um, there's no camping spots, no hedge glitching spots. There's no bullshit like that. So it's overall, it's a really good thing. It's a really good map. Grind is a pretty, it's pretty crazy. Grind, grind has got a lot of curved surfaces. Now, curved surfaces, you know, it's the first time in a COD game. So it's it's really hard to get cover, but it's still a really unique map. And it, it reminds me of Carnival from Modern Warfare 2. Don't know if you remember that map, but it was it's a really really good map. And uh, Hydro, Hydro, the, the water thing in the middle, pisses me off. It pisses me off. Now, I'll, I'm just going to be honest straight there. Literally, like, I've died so many times. Like, you hear the guy shouting in some different language, and it, and it kills you. And the water kills you. I, I don't know any game that makes water kill you, um, except from GTA Vice City. I don't know. But, jeez, water killing someone, that's not logical. Please, I mean... That is that is not logical, and I'm, I hope that's not like that in league play because league play I understand how it frustrate um, frustrate players. Now die rise I haven't tried too much. I got to uh, level five and I just died and I just gave up. But it, it looks pretty good. It looks pretty good. I'll I'll definitely make more videos of uh, die rise. But in the future I will do um a Q and A, which I will do tomorrow. Actually, I'll do it, uh, I'll do it tomorrow over some Mirage gameplay. Mirage is a pretty good map. I like Mirage. A lot of people are complaining about it. A lot of people are saying that it's just uh, spawns are off, but I like spawns. It's just personal preference in the end of the day. Here I get my orb to visa, and uh, I just wreck havoc with a yeah, just wreck havoc. I mean, this gun's amazing. It's really, really powerful. It's not overpowered, but it's powerful. It's a really, it's a really good balance between an SMG and an assault rifle. Now, this this you have to get this map. This map's a really good map. Um, a really good map pack. And this is this makes me this makes me wonder what are they going to do in the future? Because um, I heard another map called Orientation is going to come out, and I'm not sure about that. I'll definitely give you some news on that. But it's just not fair how Xbox gets it first. Because probably like maybe half people who play on Xbox already seen already seen this map. And it's just not fair for the PS3, you know, for YouTubers who play on the PS3, it's just really not fair. But still, you know, I'm uploading it, and I, I hope you like it. It's, um, it's a, this is a really good gameplay, I actually really like this gameplay. I, here I get my lightning strike, I don't normally talk about my gameplay, so I think I might start, start, um, I think maybe, maybe in this video, I'm not, I'm not even sure. But I'll definitely do a Q&A in the future. I'm just I'm just ranking up those score streaks. Hardline's a perfect perk. I've never used Hardline ever, but once I put that on, I'm always getting kill streaks. Best, best perk ever. <laughs> best perk ever. Now my uh, if you have got the DLC and you're wondering how do I do good with a peacekeeper, use grip, long barrel, and quick draw. Perfect attachments. They they they're gonna get you the kills. Now here I get my stealth chopper and it just rains havoc. On my enemies, like it's it's sad to watch, like it's it's really sad. <laughs> but um, still, it's a it's a really good gun, worth buying. Definitely buy this. Definitely buy this map pack. D don't even game share it, man. Buy it. Don't you feel sorry for Treyarch? But here I get my orbital again, and 
This was a really short gameplay, I know. It's um, five minutes long. That's because I want to make space for all my other videos. But anyway, it's been your boy Ejaz. Buy this DLC. It's, it's amazing. Really, really good DLC. And um, peace. Here you see I go 20 to 0 in just one round. So yeah. Um, like, favorite, subscribe. Please subscribe. And uh, it's been your boy Ejaz. Bye.